so here is the IC74139 and 74139 can be used as DMUX or decoder so if you are going to use it at DMUX so it will be so 1 is to 4 data distributor so 1 is to 4 DMUX dual means that the two DMUX will be available so here is DMUX 1 DMUX or decoder 1 and here is the second one or you can also use it as two line is to four line decoder first part second part two line is to four line decoder again dual it's again 16 pin IC if you see the top view of the IC pin number 1 to 16 are mentioned here so how to identify it it's a top view so there will be a notch beside the notch there will be an indication marking starting from pin number 1 so pin number 1 is the enable pin and we all know that here it is logic low enable so it should be connected to ground so logic 1 pin should be connected to ground pin number 2 and 3 are the select inputs for the first DMUX or the decoder so 1A 1B are the select inputs so they may have values 00, 01, 10 or 11 and depending on that output section will be there so in the output you have y and output 1y0 bar 1y1 bar 1y2 bar and 1y3 bar so this is the output section is selected so bar y option bar because these are also bubbled outputs as you can see here whereas pin number 8 which is again connected to ground to activate the IC pin number 16 connected to VCC that is nothing but D plus 5 volt supply so it is plus 5 volt DC supply or plus VCC also you can call it as so similar structure is there for 2A and 2B pin for the second IC here pin number 14 and pin number 13 these are 2A and 2B select lines for these marks or the decoder 2 line is to 4 line decoder and the outputs are again here bubbled out means what they will give you logic low output pin number 15 and pin number 1 that are connected to these are called as enable pins if your enable is ground then it will be work as a decoder and if enable is VCC it is working as a DMUX so that's all about the DMUX or the decoder IC 74139 and 74138 thank you for watching in 5 minutes and stay tuned